This is JSA TV, the newsroom for telecom and data center professionals. I'm Dean Perrine of JSA, and we are coming at you live from Metro Connects 20, Metro Connects, it's Metro Connect 2023 in beautiful Fort Lauderdale, Florida. And I am here with Mr. John Denmark. John is the SVP and GM at Newstar. John, welcome to JSA TV. Thank you. Yeah, you bet, you bet. John, for our viewers that don't already know, why don't you tell them a little bit about Newstar? Sure. Well, why don't I introduce myself and New Star do, at the same time? Do, why do, don't we do go? It all, okay. Do it all. all right. It's, so, it's all so yours. as you said, I'm the SVP and GM for um, Carrier Provisioning Division of New Star, and we're a transunion company now. Okay. I'll tell you a little bit more about that in a sec. So, um, I live in Northern Virginia. Mm -hmm. I've got uh, two boys that are at school, so my wife and I are empty nesters now. For New Star, congratulations! Oh well, thank you. <laughs> We're still getting used to it. So um, for New Star, you know, New Star was created uh, back in 1996 to address um, the uh, um, porting uh, portability challenge for uh, the United States and Canada. So one of the main interoperability challenges for the telecom. Uh, industry back then. Mm -hmm. And with our carrier provisioning division, we have continued that focus on interoper interoperability. Say that, yeah, say no, that a couple of no times in you. a row. Okay. <laughs> so um, whether that's on the numbering or porting sides where we started, or now um, automating the um, um, intercarrier ordering platforms, mm -hmm. that's kind of where we're focused. And what we're bringing to market is new and innovative solutions in the space that make uh, the ordering of wholesale network access simpler, automated, easier, better customer experience. So let's talk about that. How yeah. does that how does that work? I mean, obviously that comes with its own unique set of challenges. How are you the, addressing those challenges? Right. So so the main challenges in this space uh, is that there are thousands of carriers, mm -hmm. literally both in the US and internationally that sell network in some way, shape, or form. They sell their network access, right? The last mile, for example, they sell ethernet, broadband, so internet-based connectivity, mm -hmm. a bunch of different products. Um, and there is no real standard out there that standardizes that and makes that simple. And so the carriers that are selling, they have their own little spin on that, right? And the carriers that are buying find that experience difficult. And then that ex that difficult experience then impacts the end users experience, mm -hmm. the enterprises that are the ultimate customers yeah, here, yeah. right? And so what we do to solve that is we've created something called Universal Order Connect, it, uh, UOC for short. And uh, it's been called the Swiss Army knife of ordering, right? So we can we can take care, we solve that challenge because our customers whether they're on the buy side and they're buying or they're on the sell side that are selling, we simplify this world for them. And we connect the buyers and the sellers in a standardized way that makes that process simple mm -hmm. and more automated. You, you could not be segueing any better than I could myself. Um, that automation, let's talk about that because yeah. that to me feels like it's probably key to the whole system. Oh, absolutely. I mean, part of the reason that this is a difficult, uh, difficult process is that um, it is not automated typically, right? Mm -hmm. That there are standalone legacy systems that don't talk to each other. There's a bunch of swivel chair in between. And what we do with our solution is, is, is we kind of solve that that problem. We're an API-based solution that you can um, integrate with your OSS and BSS stacks, mm -hmm. and that you can integrate across the ordering platforms. And so then we make those orders flow. And once you do that, you all of a sudden start to see uh, scalability issues go mm -hmm. away, resolved, right? You get cost per order down. Um, you get cycle times that are shorter now than they used to be. Um, there are a number of benefits that our customers see mm -hmm. um, that are really transformative to the way that they do business once they implement the solution. That's again great segue. <laughs> um, so to me, to me, like, everything that you're talking about ultimately has um, an, an impact on how business gets done. Correct. Within yeah. the industry. Yeah. So so put on put on you can take out your crystal ball and let me know. So. In an ideal world, your solution does what for the marketplace? Oh, well, in an ideal world, we connect the entire ecosystem and we're able to automate that process from front to back. Um, th there is some attempts at automation in other ways. And, mm -hmm. 
And, you know, sometimes people focus on a task and they want to automate that, right? Well, in a perfect world, honestly, the process end to end is automated. So you can do your serviceability check. You can get your quote. You can turn that into an order. The order is placed. If there's a problem later with that order, you can create a self, uh, um, service assurance ticket. Right. I mean, it, it's all, and that's what we provide. We provide that entire functionality that can pull that process together on our customer's behalf. So well beyond traditional CPQ. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, interesting. Yeah. And we've got partners, you know, that yeah. we can bring into the fold. Like we don't do the quoting ourselves, uh -huh. but because we're API based, we can pull that together and, and make it flow. I love it. I love it. And thank you very much for being here. Yeah, no, it was my pleasure. Yeah. Thank you for the time. Of and course, I appreciate of course. It. For our viewers that would like to know more about New Star, where should they go? Well, they should go to uh, they should go to newstar.com. Okay, okay perfect. so let's let's go there. Yeah, uh, go to our website. Um, look for the communication solutions and carrier provisioning, and and we've got a lot of great um, uh, material out there. And of course, you can email me at any time. And I, I John dot Denmark at, <laughs> at team this dot is, newstar this N E U S T A R for all the interviews. <laughs> you, you, you've got it. You've got it, John. Thank you so much. Oh no, thank you. You bet. You bet. And thank you, viewers, for watching JSA TV. We'll see you soon.